Like in many other places in Africa, real estate is booming in Nigeria. All across major urban centers, large office blocks and buildings compete for space with glass and concrete towers. Investors say their returns are world class. Real estate in Nigeria is a very, very viable business. I've tried to do estate in South Africa. I've tried in Joburg, I've tried in, in Southern area. But I found out that coming back home here, especially in Lekki, very close to where I stay, alone, talkless of coming via to Suleri, mainland. As in when you talk of a good viable business one can do. Property is a very good business. In recent years, Nigeria has witnessed a wave of retail construction in its major cities in attempts to harness their investment potential. According to official statistics, despite continued local and foreign direct investment into the real estate sector, there remains a total deficit of about 16 million new homes to meet ever-rising demand. What the government means to do, as in the, 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 what, what, what the promise they made in solving the issue of housing problem for a layman. For example, you and I, you earn maybe 3 million per annum or 4 million per annum, and your NHI is like average of 30, 40,000 or 50 that comes out from your salary every month. Fine, such thing, it's, if, in fact, is the easiest way of solving the issue of housing problem in Nigeria, not even in Lagos. Despite the boom, however, observers point out the same criticisms as in other major African markets with a market focus on the upper end of the market. Recently, the Nigerian government invested billions of dollars to reclaim land from the Atlantic Ocean, reclaiming over 10 kilometers of land from the ocean to put up a city expected to hold up to 400,000 residents. Peter Kaba, CCTV.